Excellent, excellent. Everybody's happy with the videos I've been doing here in the class of Arnold Cooking School. Very nice. Uh, I have good reviews and um, a lot of people is being subscribed and a lot of questions and a lot of answers. Okay, here we have a butternut squash and also I have some nuts here just to eat it. So we put this aside. It's talking about nuts. So this is butternut squash. See the way it look. We're gonna cut it. You're gonna see the center, it's a little hard. It's because it's like nuts. They call it nuts is because they look like nuts. But it's a squash. Right here. Beautiful. So you can use it like that. You can cook it like that. Put some olive oil. Maybe salt. For me, I don't think so they need any seasoning. And you put it in the oven for 45 minutes and 30 325 degree and it's gonna be soft like butter you can scoop it and you can serve it whatever you like with any fish steak it's a good dish okay I'm gonna take just half I'm gonna scoop some of the center I'm gonna peel it. The skin. Okay, here we, we we can cut in different ways. Depending how you're gonna use it. Some for I'm gonna make some dice. And I'm gonna cook it in boiling water with a little salt and that's good quick let me try it's already cooking the hot water you can cut it this way and you remember those Julian onions I showed you before so you can make a saute onions with a little fresh oregano and you saute this olive oil and you combine and you have a nice dishes with onions and very nice squash. This one here you can roast it in the oven like I say in the beginning and you just cut a little part here and you serve in the plate like this and you can stuff with risotto a salad with shrimp fruit anything you like but it's a nice presentation after you roast it after you cook it in the same way you can steam it steam is gonna be a little soft but you can stuff it whatever you like it's up to you in the future I'm gonna show you how I will do it okay so see you next time and don't forget to subscribe